this is how you auto smooth in geometry nodes. If you already know what you're doing, then this should be enough. If not, keep watching. Create a cylinder and we want this smooth part of the cylinder to be shaded smooth while maintaining the sharp edge. Usually you'll grab a set shade smooth node in geometry nodes to shade things smoothly. But the problem is we want this hard edge and it's smoothing everything. So this isn't exactly what we want. When we right click and shade auto smooth, we don't see anything happen despite it turning on for the object. That information is still in the group input node with our original geometry. So what we're gonna wanna do is create a join geometry node and we can actually get that information by joining the geometry after the set shade smooth. Now we have the correct auto smooth information, but it's showing the original plane that we had before we added this cylinder. The thing is we actually can't just get rid of the entire plane because if we do that, we don't get the information about auto smooth that allows the normals to look the way that we want. So if we bring that back, what we can do though, if we hit the M key and merge at center, we're leaving this one vertice here that still has the information that we want so we can actually shade auto smooth. And now we have the effect that we want and that's about it.